The Bible says, Grace be with you. Mercy and peace. From God the Father and from the Lord Jesus Christ, the Son of the Father, in truth and love. Here John extends greeting, and he offers his readers grace, mercy, and peace from God. And you and I, as children of God, are equally extended those same blessings today. God the Father and the Lord Jesus Christ offer you grace, mercy, and peace. Oh, what a blessing. Oh, what an extension. Oh, what a greeting. Please notice the motivation behind that greeting. Notice the bona fides behind that greeting. Notice God's guarantee behind that greeting. That that grace, that mercy, and that peace is extended to you in truth and love. You don't have to doubt the grace, the mercy, and the peace because they come from God in truth and love. They come in truth. They come without a shadow of a doubt that they are real, that they are verifiable, that they can be trusted. They're extended to you in truth. Jesus said, I am the truth. God said his word is truth. So if God tells you he's extending you grace, unmerited favor, mercy, less than you deserve in terms of punishment, peace, rest, you know that if God said it, you can trust it. It's extended to you in truth with all the believability, with all the foundation, with all the trustworthiness you can muster. And secondly, it's offered to you in love with the best motivation, with a heart from God himself, with the kindness of our loving Savior, you don't have to doubt the grace. You don't have to wonder about the mercy. You don't have to question the peace and perhaps the ulterior motive that God may have because God extends that to you in love, complete benevolence and selfless sacrifice. So today, you've got God's guarantee of grace, mercy, and peace in truth according to the word of God and love according to to the great heart of our blessed Savior, God the Father and the Lord Jesus Christ.